Uh, it's actually Halloween. <laughs> uh, my friend from Europe got confused about American holidays and thought it was Thanksgiving. But no, it's not. It's All Hallowed's Eve, which a lot of folks who know are Samhain. So what's going on is that, the, you know, people aren't going out in large numbers, but a few of us are getting together here and there. I'm out on the water right now. Uh, I had my spooky friend with me earlier, but maybe I'll show you her later. But we are going to go over to the White Swan and meet with Juliana, uh, our friend from Sao Paulo, Brazil. I will be wearing a mask. It's okay, it just adds to my costume. Anyway, this is Mark Taylor Canfield. Either that or a vampire. Take your choice, it is Seattle, there are a lot of vampires here. Okay, happy Halloween! <laughs> So we were doing great, making good time against some pretty he uh, strong headwind there for a while. Uh, Solaris is just now starting to go over the horizon. But uh, then, but then we run into this, you know, rather modest sized boat over here. My friend's boat, right? So. I mean, it's just kind of small, not a really big boat or anything, just, you know, I don't know, a couple hundred feet or something. Yeah, a big yacht. So, but that's Seattle. There are a lot of big boats down here. And believe it or not, you can actually rent a lot of boats and you can join these memberships where you pay your, uh, I don't know, multi-thousand dollar membership and you can actually then have boats that you don't own that you can take out at your leisure, so pretty big. Anyway, as compared to those, yeah, it's pretty big. It's just the water and the dock doing a dance together. It's a creek. It's a There's a famous squeak on the Virginia Five, which is a historic steam ship that I like to cruise on. I've actually been a member of the crew at one point. And we took a five-day cruise to Port Townsend, Washington. And it had a strange squeak in the steam engine, and nobody to this day has been able to figure out exactly where it's coming from. So things are quite mysterious out of the water. But we're here at the marina, and it's hard to get away from this iconic thing in Seattle. But there it is, the Space Needle. Get out from your boat, and there you are. You're at the pub, which is sort of a, a I guess, a British or a UK-style pub in that they sell a lot of ales, a lot of local uh, microbrews. I swear there are like 350 microbrews somewhere in this area, you know, near here. You, you know, you can try, like a friend of mine, try to drink every IPA possible out there in the Seattle area, but you can't really because there's so many. Boat people in general, as I always say, are pretty fun people to hang out with. So we're going to go in now and go meet Juliana. So happy Halloween once again. This is Mark Taylor Canfield from Seattle. <laughs> there she is, the Space Needle. And you can see the roof of the key arena just to the right of it. I'm actually at the White Swan and we're having a really good time. I just brought my boat right up here and I'm having good fries. They have the best fries around. If you guys are ever down here, check out the White Swan. They have a really good menu. Fresh, fresh uh, seafood chowder, which you can't get in most places in this country. So check it out. Good Pacific clams and fish, salmon, mm, good stuff. Anyway, this is Mark Taylor Canfield, and we're at the White Swan on October 31st. So, happy Halloween to everyone. We're here in the recording studio, and uh, Rin Tin wanted to say something to you, but she can't, so I'm going to say it for you. Have a happy Halloween. Yes, we had a happy Halloween tonight, didn't we, guys? So, I hope you guys had a good Halloween out there, too. This is Mark Taylor Canfield with Rin Tin and Baby Bigfoot saying... See you next time.